Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our graduation ceremony. This is a proud moment for our graduates, their families, and Newport News Public Schools. Each day, our schools focus on one mission, ensuring that all students graduate college, career, and citizen ready. Recognized as an innovative school district, Newport News Public Schools provides a curriculum that builds the skills, knowledge, and expertise that students need for 21st century success. All students are building career readiness skills through Career Pathways, which connects classroom learning to careers and internships. High school students earned 1,858 industry certifications last year, accelerating their access to technical, high-skilled careers. Through innovative instruction and new technologies, education in science, technology, engineering, and math is engaging our students in hands-on and minds-on activities. This STEM experience prepares students for further education and rewarding career possibilities. This summer, SPARK, the summer program for arts, recreation, and knowledge, is expanding to give more students hands-on academic learning and engaging enrichment opportunities. Last year's SPARK initiative earned first place in the National School Boards Association's Magna Awards program, recognizing school districts for taking bold and innovative steps in educating students. The National Association of Music Merchants Foundation recognized Newport News Public Schools as one of the best communities for music education in the country. Newport News students have access to more advanced placement courses than any other school district or private school on the peninsula. Over 2,000 high school students took 3,374 AP courses last year, with qualifying grades earning students important college credits. Many high school students are also preparing for their future through the early college program. Students can complete their high school courses during the first semester of their senior year and then attend Thomas Nelson Community College during the second semester, earning up to 19 credit hours. Over 300 seniors have successfully completed the program since its inception five years ago, including 11 hurricanes this year. Through early college, dual enrollment initiatives, International Baccalaureate and Advanced Placement courses, 89% of our high school students were enrolled in college-level coursework this school year. As part of the school division's Youth Development Initiative, over 83% of all high school students participated in clubs, sports, and activities. In the 2016 graduating class has earned over $37 million in college scholarships. Heritage graduates received $8 million of this total toward their higher education. Heritage also boasts an excellent sports program, with student-athletes, coaches, and teams receiving recognition for their achievements in basketball, track and field, and wrestling. Heritage students are also graduating with honors, with 57 seniors earning a 3.0 GPA or higher. Heritage students gained valuable hands-on experience and IT repair certifications by restoring surplus computer hardware for 24 local students through the Virginia Student Training and Refurbishment Program. And the Hurricanes were active as productive citizens, volunteering over 21,000 hours to their community. They donated over $2,200 to the United Way and collected more than 3,000 cans of food for the Virginia Peninsula Food Bank. And now, a special welcome from a proud superintendent, Dr. Ashby Kilgore. It is an honor for me to join you today. I am pleased to share this special occasion with you and to share your pride as we celebrate the culmination of a 12-year journey. Now families, I want to thank you for your confidence in our schools and for supporting your young people. It has truly been a successful partnership. Faculty and staff, I thank you for the help and guidance that you have provided these young people on their educational journey. Your daily work will be reflected in all of their future accomplishments. 
So today's ceremony really exemplifies smart, safe schools, a rigorous curriculum and expectations, community and global outreach and service, and students working collaboratively, all in the pursuit of a great education. A great education that has prepared our graduates to be college, career, and citizen ready. Under the dedicated leadership of the school board, New Bernouze Public Schools has continued to expand options for our students so that they can meet the challenges of our global and technological future. The seven members of our school board work with our administrators to ensure that all schools are smart, safe schools and provide a strong foundation in academics as well as a nurturing environment that gives our students the knowledge and the skills they need to be college, career, and citizen ready. We are proud that New Produce Public Schools has opened doors for our students. Now we encourage them to move forward and step into their future. We thank you and best wishes. Enjoy the ceremony. Ahead lies an exciting future for these graduates. The impact these students have on this earth will be invaluable to us all. Newport News Public Schools has provided them with the tools they need for success, whether they plan to pursue a degree in higher education or enter the workforce. Congratulations to our graduates and best wishes for success in all their future endeavors.
Good morning. I am Shamika Gerald, proud principal of Heritage High School. And on behalf of the faculty and staff of Heritage High, I would like to welcome you to the commencement exercises for the graduating class of 2016. This morning is a momentous occasion in our students' lives, and we ask that you help us give this day the respect and dignity it deserves. At this time, we ask that you please take a stand and gentlemen, remove your hats as the Heritage High School NJROTC honors our great nation with the presentation of colors. And please remain standing as the Heritage High School Chorus performs the national anthem. High School Naval Junior Reserve Officer Training Corps is under the direction of Naval Science Instructor Chief Michael Gardner and Lieutenant Commander Eric Tyson. The color guard for today's ceremony is Seaman Apprentice Destiny Bowie carrying the national flag. Seaman Apprentice Nikayla Hill carrying the state flag. Seaman Apprentice Trayla Bradley carrying the port rifle. And Seaman Apprentice Tanya Barmer carrying the starboard rifle. Many de dedicated school division officials have provided the support necessary to bring us to today's graduation ceremony, including the superintendent and the school board. We are honored to have many of these individuals present today. Please join me in recognizing 
Superintendent Dr. Ashby Kilgore. Dr. Kilgore has served as superintendent for nine years. During this time, she has developed a rigorous academic agenda that ensures all students graduate college, career, and citizen ready. Also joining us today are several members of the school board and the school district administrative team. School board chairman, Jeff Stodgill. Mr. Stodgill is an architect based in Hilton Village. He is a graduate of Newport News Public Schools and he is active in many community activities. Mr. Stodgill was elected to the school board in 2010. School board vice chairman, Gary Hunter. Mr. Hunter is, the, is an assistant vice president of a local credit union. He is a member of numerous community organizations and is a strong propon proponent of preparing students to be college and career ready. He was elected to the school board in 2014. School board member, Carlton Ashby. Mr. Ashby taught kindergarten for 35 years in Newport News and Hampton. He currently serves as a preschool enrichment teacher and a teen leadership director. He has served on the school board since 2006. School board member, Mr. Douglas Brown. Mr. Brown is a statistical consultant for the federal government. A former educator, he is a product of public schools and has a passion for STEM education and technology. He was elected to the school board in 2014. School board member, Mr. Teddy Hicks. Mr. Hicks retired from Newport News Public Schools after 32 years of service as a teacher, coach, and administrator, and he continues to serve his community and church education programs. Mr. Hicks has served on the school board since 2006. School board member, Mr. Darian Scott. Mr. Sco Mr. Scott is an Air Force veteran and a graduate of Newport News Public Schools. He is an advocate of youth development and family involvement. Mr. Scott was elected to the school board in 2012. School board member, Shelly Simons. Ms. Simons is a former educator and school PTA president. She is a strong supporter of STEM education and nutrition programs for all students. Ms. Simons has served on the school board since 2012. Also with us this morning, Assistant Superintendent of Business and Support Services, Mary Lou Rosso. Chief, Ac Chief Academic Officer, Brian Nichols. And from the Virginia House of Delegates, we have Delegate Marcia Price representing the 95th District, Councilwoman Sandra Nelson Cherry, and Councilwoman Tina Vick. It is my pleasure to introduce your Heritage High School Senior Class President, Ms. Naya Marks. Ms. Marks is a varsity athlete in volleyball and soccer. In addition to her athletic accomplishments, she is a member of various student organizations, such as Students Against Destructive Decision Making, Mu Alpha Theta National Math Honor Society, Future Business Leaders of America, National Honor Society, Citywide Student Council, and is currently serving as your senior class president. She plans to attend Old Dominion University in the fall, where she will study marketing management. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Ms. Naya Marks. Good morning. My name is Naya Marks and I am the senior class president. First, I would like to take a moment to congratulate the class of 2016. An overall summary of our last four years can be described as indelible. In other words, it was lit. On September 12, 2012, we nervously strolled into the doors of Heritage. Soon after that, it was set in stone that these outstanding students in the audience would embody a common passion to graduate. As underclassmen, we were introduced to difficult classes, which taught us to prioritize. But it was junior year that we were all hit with a huge challenge. Honors and AP classes weighed heavy on our shoulders, and we spent countless hours with our heads in books. This was also the year we said goodbye to our former principal, Mr. Nichols, and welcomed a new principal, Ms. Gerald. She taught us all to be in the right place, at the right time, doing the right thing. Then came senior year. Although we were all overwhelmed with our adult duties, we still managed to enjoy our last quarter of the four-year journey. We even left the school with something to remember. Our basketball team had such a successful season, making it all the way to the state's game. This year, many of us have found our passion. Some may have a passion for basketball, like Jermaine. 
Art like Natalie, math like Robin, or technology like Joseph. Throughout the adventures of finding what our passions were, we have all experienced some degree of failure. Whether the struggle was discovering a new study tactic or not making the cuts to the All Virginia Choir, your lesson was learned. Class, do not be afraid to fail or make mistakes. These are the times in our lives we are to experiment and take risks. These steps are essential to furthering us in life. As we leave today and begin our new journeys, we must not forget those who have taught us valuable lessons. For me, it was R. Celia Simmons and Coach Leakes who taught me about selflessness and forgiveness. We must also cherish the friendships we've made, some which lasted the entire four years. Growing up, my mother always told me, if you aren't learning anything from the people you are hanging around, these are not your friends. My best friends, Anya, Treasure, Marlon, and Morgan, have built a sound relationship with me and supported me through anything. Although we are all so young, I have learned so much from these individuals. They have become my family. My goal for the future and my challenge for all of the 2016 graduates is to come back, not only to reminisce about the times we've had, but to take those experiences and turn them into, into ideas that will change our community for the better. Lastly, I would like to thank those who positively impacted my high school experience. To the faculty and staff, thank you for your determination and education to the students here at Heritage. And to my family, my mother Sonia, my sister Tia, and my brother Justin, I love you all more than I could ever put into words. Throughout everything from breakdowns to soccer games, I could count on you all. Thank you for doing an amazing job in raising me into the young lady I am today. There are plenty more accomplishments to come. Class of 2016, this is our time to shine, and this moment is so surreal. As we become Heritage High School alumni, we must change the way our alma mater has been portrayed. Show them that Heritage gives birth to individuals who will go on to do extraordinary things. It has been a pleasure to rock maroon and silver. We will now hear the final musical selection from a distance from performed by the award-winning Heritage High School Choir under the direction of Miss Arcelia Simmons.
Heritage High School has a legacy of valedictorians and salutatorians that are active in our school and local community. This year is no exception. It is my pleasure to invite our class of 2016 salutatorian, Ms. Jericho Casper, to the podium to give her salutatorian's address. Jericho is co-captain of our volleyball team, participates in Project Inclusion, a member of the PBIS team, National Honor Society, and Mu Alpha Theta National Honor Society. Ms. Casper plans to attend the University of Virginia in the fall, where she will study political science. Ladies and gentlemen, Ms. Jericho Casper. Good morning, everyone. It is my pleasure to represent the class of 2016 as your salutatorian. When I began to write this speech, in true senioritis fashion, on the night before it was due, I simply had no idea how to start it, and I couldn't t figure out why. However, I finally realized that it's simply not feasible to ask someone to summarize the three most significant years of their life in under three minutes. I'm not over-exaggerating when I say my years at Heritage High School have made me the person that I am today. The fact is, whether you've been a hurricane for all four years of high school, or you transferred in a couple months ago, your time at Heritage has shaped you. Whether it was in the classroom, on the court, or in the community, I promise you, class of 2016, you are not the same person you were when you first walked in the front door. I remember my first time walking through Heritage's front doors. It was the summer before my sophomore year, and I was taking an impromptu tour <laughs> of the school. Impromptu meaning mom, I'm not exactly sure we were supposed to be in the building. <laughs> However, I met two teachers on this day who ended up being the two most influential people in my life during my time at Heritage. My volleyball coach, Ms. Crew, and my English teacher, Mr. Krause. Like me, I'm sure everyone remembers their first time entering those doors because it's truly a momentous occurrence. As underclassmen, we entered high school thinking we were as cool as it gets, but now as seniors, we look back with unmistaken clarity that we were not cool by any definition of the word. <laughs> but thankfully, high school progressed, and as we expanded our knowledge on polynomial functions and the periodic table, we also picked up on other things that we had not noticed as underclassmen. We noticed things like the fact that you can't walk past Mr. Chandler without hearing him say, it's a great day to be a cane. We realized Ms. Gerald is not actually Beyonce's biggest fan, but Beyonce herself. As we've progressed throughout high school, we've not only learned the tricks of the trade, but we've also made countless memories together. As the class of 2016, we know that football season is the real deal. We know that the highlights of the year are the pep rallies, homecoming week, and prom. On a more serious note, we know following countless losses of students gone unquestionably too soon, what it means to appreciate life. And we also know what community feels like. We know that some teachers are like second parents and at many times high school's greatest lessons were learned through conversations at desks rather than in a classroom. We know a lot and while we may not know it all, what I knew, do know is this, that we have grown tremendously over the past four years, both intellectually and in unity with one another. As However, this is not all because of our own doing. Essentially, we have been shaped into who we are today because of every person that came here this morning to support us. Thank you to every person who has aided a member of our class throughout the years. Every parent, teacher, and friend, every administrator, coach, and family member, none of us would have made it to this monumental point without the support provided to us by you. Finally, I'd like to say a special thank you to some of my favorite people that came here to support me today but above that, who have been supporting me throughout my entire life. Mom, Dad, Teresa, Jacob, and Caroline, thank you for always loving me and for backing me through my decisions big and small. I wouldn't be here without each of you and I love all of you dearly. Now, class of 2016, it is my honor as your salutatorian to say congratulations to each of you. Today, June 11th, 2016, is truly a great day to be a cane. Now, it is my pleasure to invite our class of 2016 valedictorian, Miss Morgan Ryan, to the podium <laughs> to give her valedictorian's address. Morgan is the 2015-2016 student representative of the Newport News Public Schools School Board, a member of National Honor Society, a member of Mu Alpha Theta National Math Honor Society, Vice President of our senior class, Secretary for Students Against Destructive Decision Making, and we share the role of captain for our school's volleyball team. 
Morgan plans to attend the University of Virginia in the fall. Ladies and gentlemen, Ms. Morgan Ryan. <laughs> Thank you, Jericho. Class of 2016, for the longest time we've been tweeting, June 11th, where are you at? Well, my fellow classmates, June 11th has arrived. Now, where do we go? As hurricanes, it is time to take the world by storm. Today marks a new beginning in all of our lives, and that may seem terrifying or liberating, but just think, we are no longer considered kids. Although we are not grown, we are young adults with greater responsibilities on our shoulders. June 11th is an ending to our long four years of high school, but it is also the start of a new chapter. Imagine this stage as our entire senior year. Then imagine the steps leading up to the stage as our journey from the start of our scholastic tour to our senior year. Every step leading up to the stage came with a challenge. Whether it was getting your first job or getting accepted into college, each was a personal challenge that we all had to overcome. As we approached the final step that led us into our senior year, a sense of excitement, satisfaction, and maybe a little sadness overcame us as we realized that our final year was here. Our senior year was filled with trials and tribulations. No one was prepared for what this year was going to bring us. Ups and downs, demanding senior dues, friendships coming and going, and starting to find ourselves. We have developed our own views from our own six, which can also be known as 5800 or Marshall Avenue. So while we have gained our views from 5800, we have also been running through heritage with our woes. Those woes may include struggling with senioritis, dealing with high school drama, or juggling all of your activities while still trying to maintain honor roll. All has led us to our final moments of this senior year and the final steps we are about to take. We are also walking the stage alone for a reason. No one is there to hold our hands, not our parents, not our teachers, and not our friends. This walk is essential to be taken on our own. So unfortunately, parents, it is time to loosen the ties we love you so much and we thank you, but it's time to let us create our own path just as you have. As we approach the end of the stage, realize that the June 11th step is here and will soon be gone. Our next step is toward a wide ocean called life, an endless horizon that, of, that is full of doubt, uncertainty, but vast opportunities. And as you walk back to your seat, remember that you are taking the steps away from June 11th to your future. These steps you are taking shall create a major storm ready to conquer anything. It was once said, a hurricane season may not be forever, but it is a, hur a, but it is a rum humbling reminder that despite our technologies, most of nature remains unpredictable. Throughout our hurricane season, remember that your path may take you to unexpected places. The challenge is to accept those unpredictable moments. And with those moments, remember that a hurricane makes its mark and leaves behind inherent reminders to announce that the hurricane has passed through. Create your mark and leave something behind. Do not forget what you have accomplished as a heritage hurricane. Remember what it takes to be a hurricane. And most importantly, never forget that you are a relentless, perseverant, proud, and resilient storm. Congratulations, class of 2016. We finally made it. Good morning, the class of 2016 leaves Heritage High School. Before they move on, their legacy deserves recognition. Their efforts and persistence have continued the hurricane tradition, which demands the involvement of students in their school and community while honoring the unique talents of all students. Please allow me to share a few of their many accomplishments with you. 25% of the graduates earned a GPA of 3.0 or higher for their four years in high school. 50% of the seniors maintain a GPA of at least 2.0, and this class average is a 2.5 GPA. 23 seniors earn presidential awards for academic earn excellence, earning at least a 3.5 or better. They have earned over 228 industry certifications, preparing them to thrive in a world of ever-changing technology. Our graduating hurricanes have been busy serving their school and community. 76% participated in a school activity, and 77 students earned a University Magnet or Governor STEM Academy seal for dedication to pursuing academically rigorous coursework. 
66% participated in athletics, and seven of our top 10 are student athletes. 71% held a job while attending high school, and 62% performed volunteer work in our school community. The class of 2016 has received over $8.2 million in scholarship offers to continue their education. If you distribute that over the entire senior class, that is approximately $35,000 per student. And finally, after, the, after graduation, the Heritage High School class of 2016 has important plans for their future. 31% plan to immediately apply the knowledge they have gained by entering the workforce or technical fields. 15% will serve our great nation in the military. And 54% will further their academic growth by attending our two or four year college or university. Families and guests, please join me in applauding the outstanding achievements, service, and future of our graduates. As we celebrate your accomplishments, I would like to take a moment to say thank you to the class of 2016. Thank you for making the tough choices and the sacrifices necessary to bring you today. Thank you for being great examples for the underclassmen through your commitment to the values we hold dear as canes and belief that every cane can make a difference. Thank you for allowing all of us the opportunity to share in your growth as young men and women. Before you leave this Coliseum as graduates, I would like to leave you with one final thing. Always be in the right place at the right time doing the right thing. If you really think about it, that's what got you here today. Congratulations, Class of 2016. It is now my pleasure at, to ask at this time, Ms. Marks, Ms. Casper, and Ms. Ryan, please join your classmates and also ask that our first door graduates now stand and proceed to the stage. Before, before we bring in the presentation of diplomas, I would like to remind the audience that it is important that each family hears the name of their guest. We ask that you applaud the graduates with respect and refrain from extensive celebrations that will prevent students and families from hearing the next name as it is called. It is important to note that this commencement exercise will be viewed by our servicemen and women who will be stationed around the world. The Heritage High School Class of 2016 will now receive their diplomas as a visible sign of their graduation from high school. Felicia Dawn Abeda. Felicia Antonia Alexander. Kelsey Valerie Austin. Linwood Bernard Austin. Chantela Amala Anderson. Taylor Justice Devanna Anderson. Elijah Jordan Atua. Severus Kualik Banks. Natanavi Chalarik Barnes. Bailey Barnett. Destiny Alexandra Bell. Asia Monique Beverly. Traquan T. Billups. Michelle Nadolin Bidding. Tyson Antoine Bibbins. Kayla N. Bolden. Sarika Chiselle Bowley. Destiny Nicole Boykins. 
Cabrera Chanel Broward. Dynasty Lapore Brown. Malik Daquan Brown. Michaela Deshaun Brown. Tariq Paris Brown. Denzel Demonte Bug. Vincent Lamont Bullock Jr. Anthony Nishé Bumpers. Justin Shamar Bunch. Kenneth Allen Burgess Jr. Justin Jamal Burke. Dominique Renee Bird. Danielle Leanne Caldwell. Tatiana Collier. Raekwon Lee Kim. Tawar Tarrant Kennedy Jr. Jericho Renee Casper. Gloria Rose Chandler. Shelton Lindell Chapman Jr. Charles James Cohen. Jerani Nobles Hopelaw. Treasure Bravon Cole. Summer Jade Cook. Stanley Cornelius Cooper Jr. Destiny Shaquan Copeland. Justin Dale Cornelius. Shakira Naray Cotton. Casey Ty Crandall. Kaydon Paul Cyrus. Asia Monet Davis. Tashika Renee Davis. Fatia Abike Gaudu. Tequila Tatiana Diaz. Thomas Devante Dicker. James Julius Dixon. Nature Nicole Dorset Johnson. Deshaun Raheem Douglas. Simone Elise Douglas Shepherd. Tasia Leona Dudley. Dial Eason. Natalie Brooke Estes. Corinthio Demond Azell Jr. Jabrion Miandas Azell. Lynette Alondra Farmer. Priyanka Nataja Farrell. Shayla Marie Fleming. Demetrius Cortez Flowers. Lanisha Janae Foster. Etra Shadai Garcia. Bradley Charles Gardner. Jalen Damone Blasco. 
Marquise Love Glasberg. Rashina Cassandra Godbolt. Inez Octavia Goff. Octavia Denise Gordon. Taylor Sedaria Grant. Imani Lachelle Gray. Jerry Ramon Gray. James Robert Griffin. David Jonathan Guy. Danny Lamont Hall. Deanna Nicole Hamilton. Shantae Hampton. Tashana Marie Hardy. Philip Michael Harley. Donald Jermaine Harmon Jr. Tyler Jamal Harrell. Jimmy Jerome Harris Jr. Evan Isaiah Harrison. Robert Harrison III. Benyana Tarshell Hartsfield. Talik Isaiah Haywood. Christopher Coleman Hewitt. Ashanti Monique Hill. Jasmine Lachey Hines. Demetria Imani Hinton. Olivia Shanae Hobson Love. Amari Tajay Yvonne Dorian Holmes. Marlon Jermaine Huff Jr. Elijah Huggins. Asia Amani Jackson. Asia Kenesha Jackson, Stanley Jackbar, Diana Marie Jennifer, Cassandra Lynn Jenkins, Amarche Ruth Johnson, Taisha Adonis Johnson. Ashante Lachey Jones. Armani Deanna Jones. Brandon Jones. Jalen Khalil Jones. Precious Lene Jones. Raylanza Tyrese Jones. Chiante Adoria Jordan. Daquan Tremaine Jordan. Jordan Jorner. Sabria Jorner. Sierra Key Bailey. Ezekiel Keaton. Deontay Christopher King. Autumn Rain Laguna. Thailand Sarik Harry Ikaika Lee. Kanisha Lewis. Raynesha Lewis. Keenan O'Brien Livingston. Jaquana Shanae Logan.
Taekwon and Monty Love. Amani Nicole Lundy. Malik Arkane Irvin Major. Zaria Jane Maldonado. Brianna Esteem Manigault. Joshua Emmanuel Manning. Naya Monet Marks. Brandon Ernesto Marrero. Jermaine Delmar Maro. Jordan Lee Martin. Kataro Wesley Martin. Omar Martin Jr. Danae A. McDuffie. Simone Tatiana McMillan. Devin Tyrell Moore. Kenyatta Renee Moore. Jumani Van Wesley Mormon Jones. Brian Rendell Munden Jr. Deja Monet Nolan. Jaleel Malik Outlaw. Ashani Alea Parker. Drew Parishkumar Patel. Nasaja Rosa Castell Pearson. Treshawn Devon Perkins. Raekwon A. Cataway. Ashir Tariq Phillips. Jolani Malik Presto. Jamel George Presti. Kwanye Rashandra Price. Shakira Monet. Patrice Randolph. Jeremy Nicholas Rashin. Artasia Imani Latre Richardson. Tamaris Laquan Richardson. Devin Martel Riddick. Joseph Carlos Ritter, Joanna Valentina Roberson, Janaja Unique Robertson, Horatio C. Robinson Jr., Sajada LaShawn Royal, Wilfred Russell Jr., Morgan Jean Ryan. Taylor Sheree Scott. Kiara Sherelle Shaw. Destiny Chanel Shields Tucker. Anya Elizabeth Simmons. Christian Joseph Cuba Simmons Pegray. Imani Nia Sinclair. Ryan Alexander Singleton. 
Lillian Marie Smith. Sherrod Isaiah Smith. Shaniqua Arnaz Spitz. Jalen Rashawn Sproul. Kasaya Jaquela Stevenson. Trayvon Stevens. Lee Ann Summerfield. Malcolm Allah Swilling. Rami Isaiah Switzer. Rajane Chinese Tally. Dana Felicia Taylor. Teresha Lene Taylor. Javon Laquell Tichi. Sierra Celeste Tebow. D'Angela Shante Larice Thomas. Joshon Denoris Thomas. Jakira Monet Thomas. Caleb Callie Trayvon Thomas. Tatiana Katora Thomas. Nathan Thomas, Ayana Naisha Thomas, Thompson, Angelique Marie Torres, Takari Tatton, Deshaun Tucker Bailey. Kenya Quezzy Turner, Laurel Madison Vaughn, Marisha Giselle Waddell, Linwood Darnell Walker Jr., Silas Trayvon Wall, David Anthony Walter Jr. Rebecca Rolletti Ward. Xavier Malik Ward. Jeremiah Lamont Warren. Robin Jeanette Watkins. Tatiana and Jolie Denise Watkins. Deshelle Monet Watt. David Morris Welker. Deshaun Enrique Whitby. Brianna Nicole White. Kai Nathaniel James Whitby. Alexis DePierce Wilkins. Unique Shakira Williams. Jonathan Everett Williams Baxter. Elise Renee Winslow. Seneca Tobias Woods Jr. Montreal Darjean Wynn. Will the class of 2016 now stand? By the
the authority vested in me as your principal by the Commonwealth of Virginia and the School Board of Newport News, I certify that each of you has successfully completed the course of study required for graduation. I now declare you graduates of Heritage High School. You may now move your tassel from right to left. Congratulations, Heritage High School, class of 2016.